Welcome to Good Mythical More. Motivational speech. We're going to give a motivational speech to... Let's oh, go. Oh what? The person that cleans out a porta potty using one of those suction hose thingies. Hey, man. You suck. But, but that's good. That's cool, man. You suck for a living. You suck crap out of Porta Johns for a living. And that, I mean, if that's important. If you didn't do that. Think about all the piles of oh, crap that gosh. would be all around if you didn't do your job, man. The more that I think about it, you are one of my favorite people on the planet because there's nothing better than the dread of going into a Porta John yeah. being masked and surpassed mm -hmm. and replaced entirely by the fact that it's freshly sucked. As a matter of fact, by I you. wanna shake your hand. You know what, I, actually I don't wanna shake, I, give me a fist bump. Thank you. Keep doing what you're doing, you're my favorite person. Do it more often. Oh my goodness. All right, so we're reacting to swimsuits. Here's one that um, the bikini top is... Hands. Hands. This is like that Janet Jackson Rolling Stone cover. Who's, you know whose hands those were? Hers. But she was going like all the way around and... No, it was Justin Bieber's. No, it wasn't. He was only three. <laughs> <laughs> you, you can't mention him, man. That's against the rules. Oh. Yeah, sorry. What, what, why are you breaking the rule, man? Because it's Good Mythical More. But for that joke, you broke the it's rule? It's Good Mythical More. Oh, gosh. It's, I, I actually, it was You're gonna out, have penance. No, it was pointed out to me that I, at least, have broken the rule several times. Yes, some, you have. Because somebody was like, it's not just the first because, time that's happened. Just because you've broken it, I mean you can keep breaking it. I've never broken the rule in Good Mythical Morning, have I? It's always been Good Mythical More. Penance, shame, I demand retribution. Oh, okay. That is just wicked wrong. Hold on, but how does it stay aloft? What is happening? Well, I know. No, I don't want to. I, I mean, I have that. some theories as to what's happening, but why it's happening <clears throat> is how it's happening. That's horrifying. Take it away. Okay, here's one. What's going on here? So this oh, hold is. On. The... We're supposed to be making decisions about these. I just didn't even want to. My decision was take it away. The decision is no, thank you. As in, no thank you, but using the word sink because we're talking about swimsuits. <laughs> or swim fan. <laughs> Meaning that we we want to stalk the swimmers who are wearing this because we like it so much. Uh, well, This is a bikini made to look like um, jeans. Yeah, I'm a swim fan. Uh, I think that's novel. I like it, swim fan. Whoa, what is this? Pss, translucent board shorts? Is that underwear underneath or is that his sh shirt tucked in? I don't think it's his shirt. I do. I think it thankfully, looks like a it, shirt tucked in. Well, he has another shirt on. He has two shirts on. He has a raspberry colored shirt and a white shirt. He has a shirt, shirt that gets tucked all the way down to the crotch in parts like shorts. I doubt it. Um, Stranger things have happened to that guy. <laughs> I would say no, thank you for this one. Um, yeah, that's just stupid. No, thank you. I don't like clear clothes. Not Th that's not a swimsuit. swimsuit. That's on, just a that's an athletic supporter. And is that a third drawstring in the middle? What is happening there? How do you tie that knot? You braid it. <laughs> oh, give me a second. I have to braid my. <laughs> gotta braid my shorts. No, thank you. <clears throat> Something about that guy's abs make him look simultaneously cut and fat. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm not trying to judge it, but like, does it call that foot? <laughs> what? Cut and fat. fat. Cut and fat. Foot. He's foot. He's so foot, man. Foot sounds like a dirty word. I just wanted. I wanted to tear that guy down a little bit because he's so confident in his. You don't know. Support. You don't know the look on his face. He could be like really uncomfortable. Imagine that guy. Can you tilt up, please? Is this isn't a live feed of this person posing? Here's one. That's. This looks restrictive. Okay, now there's looks like a lot of trouble. There's a lot of material there that they make it seem like it's not there because it because of, of a, it's like a skin match. It's a skin match. Now, if you pull one of these things, the whole thing comes off, which that's interesting. Now, guys, help me out here. I remember my ex stepsister when she was like in middle school. Well, you really took her down a couple of notches. That's what she is. Uh, there's gotta be a better way. 
There's got to be a better way to refer to her as X Step. It just sounds she sounds so rejected. There was like this thing that you could get, and it was a baton that had a ribbon, and you would, and I think it was like there's like a Olympic routine where you can dance with one of these things, and they were marketing them to um, kids. You're talking and, about like, and she had one of those like. And you could you, baton peoples, but it's got a ribbon on it, and then you can make the ribbon ribbons, dance. Like, what do they call it? Ribbons, right? Yeah, you make right. the ribbon, ribbon dance. Ribbon dancing. Like, it yeah. Came in like pink and white. Yeah, pink and white. <laughs> yeah, David did it. Yeah, you had one of those, David. <laughs> My sister had one. Yeah. Your ex stepsister? <laughs> His actual sister. Wow. Right. Okay. And is this an Olympic sport that like these kids are emulating? I believe so. Yes. And this woman's wrapped up in one of them. That's what I'm getting at. She was an she was an accidental she was a contestant and there was an accident and then she became a model when she couldn't get it off. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, that's permanently attached. That sounds, that's a sound theory. I'm a swim fan. Now. What is it called in the Olympics? Rhythmic gymnastics. Rhythmic gymnastics. But it's a ribbon. It's rib, ribbon gymnastics. Oh, ribbon. 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 That's so weird. I think it's beautiful. Swim fan. Last one here. Um Wow, that, that looks very constrictive in the front and very... Well, what if you wore it backwards? Open in the back. If you wore it backwards, that it'd would be really, really restrictive. That really hurt. That would yeah. be a punishment. I've never worn a thong, but what's the... What's the appeal? No. Well, yeah, what's the personal appeal? The I mean, personal appeal well, what's for the, you, the wearer? Very what, little, I believe. What's the... N I think it's to it's not, a, it's not, not, not show, show underwear a, an underwear line. Yeah. But what's the adjustment period for wearing uh, a thong? Like, when does your butt ignore it? Yeah, like how? When does how, your butt crack forget that it's how, there? Like when I started wearing glasses, it took me a couple of months to, you know, to to adjust to the feeling of wearing glasses for the first time. What's it like to adjust to the feeling of having uh, an Olympic ribbon uh, cinched up in your? I think it varies from person to person. Do you have experience with this? Uh, well, I, once, ever worn a I once wore a very long tie, and uh, for some reason took all my clothes off except the tie. And the wind blew it really the, hard? And then I walked into a hurricane. Big gust of wind. That just... tie was stuck up my butt crack for 48 to 72 hours. I lost track somewhere in there. Anybody over there who has experience and wearing a thong, or the, is currently wearing a thong, want to get on it. mic and tell us about it? <laughs> Stevie? Stevie's not here right now. What? <laughs> after we uh, after we got out of the swimming pool, she was like, "I've had enough." If she was here, she'd probably be saying, uh, "It takes it takes approximately six weeks to get used to wearing a thong. At least that's what how long it took me." I don't have a comment about this. I'm not going to try to offer any sort of insight as to what Stevie thinks about thongs. I'll just ask my wife. Yeah, that would probably be a what safer... she thinks Stevie would have said. <laughs> We're, We're on Amazon. Amazon. Well, technically, it's just our merch. Mythical goods with prime shipping available now at amazon.com slash mythical.